Hello dear friends, finally I'm in Chicago. It's cold outside and a little bit rainy so I wear so heavy and uh, I finally, it took me three days, finally arrived to this beautiful shop Adagio and I think a lot of you know about Adagio and uh, I was received by this young nice lady, she is so kind and uh, allow me to, to make a video so we can all share this. Can you introduce yourself, your name? Or... Sure. Um, my name is Amanda. Um, I work here at Adagio Tees. Wonderful. <laughs> can we put the music down a little bit? Sure. Yeah. And then I will ask you questions. Sure. Okay, thank you. So they have this beautiful teeth. I am so happy. And the impression I got from Chicago is that people are so nice and open heart. Touch my heart. Yes. <clears throat> Connection closed very slowly. Yeah, I don't know why it's this. Whatever, yeah, whatever. It's a very zen way to say it. It doesn't work. <laughs> so, the first thing I want to know is about your Chicago tea. So the Chicago tea. I, I, sure. Thank you, sir. There's do you have anything right special too. from Chicago? Yeah, um, we've got two really cool blends. Mm -hmm. um, All right. There's the Magnificent Chamomile, which is this one here. It's a blend of white tea, uh, chamomile tea, there's some rose in there, a um, little oh, bit of that's great. No grapefruit, worries. corn flour. So it's very light, very that floral, um, and a little play on words, a magnificent mile here in Chicago, <laughs> magnificent chamomile. So, so just oh, tried yes. to... I live in Michigan. Yeah, so tried to bring that in. Um, yeah. And the artwork is actually from a no Chicago um, artist. Her name's Elena Bazzini. So it's, it's very uh, sort of special to, to Chicago. Uh -huh. And do we... Uh, <clears throat> oh, these are... Her or his? Uh, it's her, um, her Photography. artwork, her photography, yeah. Like I've never seen um, before. And this one? And then this sorry, one I is uh, the <laughs> Chicago Jazz Mint. Uh, this tea here. And that's a jasmine scented green tea with uh, peppermint, corn flour, and safflower. So it's sort of minty and sweet, has some floral notes to it. Um, brings in the sort of jazz history with Chicago. So you got some of the little photography there. You can see the city skyline. And this one is very uh, energizing. Or yeah, energizing or with the mint, a good okay. pick me up. Not um, overly caffeinated, um, mm. sort of a medium uh, caffeination, but it's a very good, refreshing one, something different. And this one is, uh, is more for a calming down, falling asleep. Yeah, asleep, much like more calming. If you had a busy day shopping or yeah. something, then yeah. you can do this one to yeah. help uh, calm down a bit. After tax today. That's interesting. And yeah. uh, I, I collect all the, the packaging. Do you have mm -hmm. any other packaging yeah. you would like to introduce? Um, we have this really cool uh, Zodiac collection. Mm -hmm. um, they're all based off of the signs of the Zodiac. Mm. So. If you're a Pisces or an wow. Aries, you've got something for every single one. Um, so pretty. And these yeah. were actually, the artwork was created by a customer of ours. Um, mm -hmm. She's actually based in New York. Uh, her name's Inguna Tripsa. Um, but yeah, each of these was blended to sort of try and match the different uh, character traits that go along with the different signs of the zodiac. Um, and they've even grouped them by elements. So you've got all the air elements, water, fire. Um, so if you want to get a mix of them, the fire one would be Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. You can get a nice little set that way. So it's the Adagio blend? Yes. Um, the, the blend was created with the, the customer that made these blends. Um, it was her idea originally, then we worked with her to help develop them, get the packaging all figured out. Um, but this was actually made by a customer. It was it was That's her so idea. That's so pretty. That's so pretty. I particularly want to look for some rubus. Some rubus tea. Um, yes. We've got a few options over mm -hmm. here. Um, all of our teas are color coded by type. Okay. So anything in yellow is going to be an herbal. Um, okay. And a rubus counts as an herbal tea. Um, you often hear about it called red tea, mm -hmm. um, but it's actually, there's no tea plant in no, it, so no. it's, yeah, yeah, just the, the rooibos. from South Africa. Mm -hmm. Yep, South Africa. And actually, we have a, um, 
program called the Roots Campaign. <laughs> this is a postcard that you can actually send to the farmer that makes our rooibos tea. Um, it's got his his name on here and the postage and everything, so you can send that to the farmer if you want to. It's already with postage. Uh, it is. It's not already attached, but it tells okay. you how much. Um, okay, I will send yeah. it. Yes, that's interesting. Um, yeah, we got different. Uh, and there's producers. the chamomile. Yeah. Different mm -hmm. producers. Yes, all different farmers. Oh. We do direct trade, so we have relationships with the farmers and, okay. and get the teas directly from the source. Okay. Um, how many tea plants do you have? Um, gosh, there, I, I have no idea. There's so many. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> the, okay. the different types that we have, there's about 245 online, mm -hmm. um, but the blends are kind of endless. You can make as many different kinds that yes. you want, which yes. is kind of the fun of teas. You can yes. make as many different flavors as you want yes. to. Yes. Um, so like here, we've got two different flavored rabuses, um, but we also have a rabus chai blend, which has um, traditional chai spices without the black tea. Mm -hmm. um, Oh, but then we've also got a green rooibos, which is a, a little oh. bit more of an unfamiliar type. Um, okay, so do you have pure? This one does go with tea? Does it have caffeine? No caffeine. Not, this is oh, just okay. an unroasted rooibos. It has a different flavor. Yes. Um, okay. Much more summery, very light. Okay. Uh, we do have plain rooibos. This is not out plain, at the pure. moment. Just pure rooibos. Yes. Yeah, we do offer that. Um, oh, okay. It's just not on the, on the wall at the moment. Yeah, it's too popular. <laughs> yeah, it is, yeah. <laughs> yes, and also I like these full teas. Yeah, these are very popular as iced teas. I'm um, from China, so I buy a lot of teas. Yeah, absolutely. And uh, I think uh, here you do a very good job on, on, on making food tea or something, yes. Yeah, they, um, these especially parents tend to like for kids as like a substitute for fruit punch and things yes. like that because they're yes. very healthy and mm. there's lots of antioxidants and they're sweet naturally so there's no extra sugar, you know, any of that bad additives or anything like that. Yeah. Do you like drinking tea? I do. I, I drink it all day. So, <laughs> do you drink coffee? Um, very little. Every once in a while, I have like okay. one cup in the morning, yes. but it's yes. it's more rare. I usually yes. just go with tea. Yeah. In France, when I was in France, there was a discussion. You are a coffee girl or tea girl. <laughs> it is <laughs> very. Interesting. Yeah. Often people are very divided on, on coffee and tea. Um, you have any um, habit of what time you drink what kind of tea? Morning, afternoon. I almost always have at least one cup in the morning, okay. um, something just sort of get the day started. Um, Is that a strong tea? Usually something stronger. Cool usually tea? a black tea. A sometimes tea. a green, but it'll be a bolder green. Okay. Um, but it it could be something like that's when I have my coffee. Sometimes in the morning. Yes. Um, Midday can be anything, it just depends on the mood and the weather and time of year. Um, yes. But uh, at night, usually I'm sticking to herbal, something very low calf, something very soothing. Yes. Um, yes. Do you drink tea with milk? Sometimes. Yeah. If it's uh, if it's like a flavored black tea or, yes. or a chai, yes. then I'll do a little bit of milk. Yes. Um, usually like an almond milk of some kind, so it, tend, it seems to go well with a lot of the flavors that I like. But, I think um, we have two minutes left for okay. this video. Uh, Chai. I think Adagio has some good chai. Some friends yes. mentioned about your mm -hmm. chai. We've got some really nice ones. Um, these are the two that we feature the most often. Okay. The masala is the more traditional one. Mm -hmm. You can see it's got all yes. the spices just thrown right in. There's no extra flavors. It's just pure spices. Okay. Um, so you got clove, cinnamon, cardamom, ginger, all that good stuff. Mm. Um, this one is a little twist on it. You got lemongrass and coconut in there. Yes. Um, but my personal favorite is actually the chocolate chai, uh -huh. which uh, we don't have a, like an open one that I can show you, but okay. it's, um, it's the masala with uh, chocolate, like cocoa nibs added to it, wow. and then a little less of the clove, so it's much sweeter, it's like mm. sort of exotic, and you yes. got that like chocolatey, spicy goodness yes. to it. Yes. Um, it's really, really tasty. A good one to blend with a lot of other teas too, so yeah. like I blend that one with rooibos caramel. You know, you can cross different types of tea and do like different things. Do you tea have loose or are all these loose tea? Yes, loose or tea bags. We do oh. both. Mm -hmm. um, the main reason for that is because so many people aren't used to doing loose yeah. tea yet. Yes. So, um, and I heard it's a triangle. Yeah. It's a pyramid. We've got little uh, silk pyramid oh, tea bags. How pretty. So Look at this. You've yes. got the same quality tea in there. It's the same loose leaf stuff that we would sell in the bags, okay. um, but just in a little silk pyramid bag like yes. this. You need a little bit more room for it to open up this way. Um, and the silk, it doesn't affect the flavor as much as a paper tea bag would. Yes. So still a good quality tea bag for sure. Um, but we usually recommend loose because the flavor tends to be a little better and it's more, more tea for your money, better value. 
Thank you. I, I think I will stop here because of the time. Sure. And uh, let's do some shopping now. All right. Thank Sounds you. good. Thank, Thank you. you. What a beautiful shop.